Welcome to the crew motor face. Oh man, I'm so excited. Awesome intense drifting action. Come on. Yes. Oh, the scenery. Oh wow. Man, I love that Mustang. Oh, there's a new buggy. Okay, okay, I like this. Oh, yes! I forgot about the new Sian. Okay, some Formula 1 cars. Red Bull as well. Oh, there's a new Porsche. Oh, there's a Supra. Oh! <laughs> Man, this game looks just incredible. Oh, we're in for a ride. What an intro. Gather up everyone. Photo time. <laughs> okay. So now I have to choose a character. Oh, okay. Okay. Um let's take let's take this one. I love this guy. Let's take him. Alright everyone, settle down. I know you're all excited. That chopper ride is always a trip. So, welcome again to the Motorfest. I'm Malu, the Motorfest PR, and I'm here to get you up to speed. Cool mural, actually. You are our special guests. Athletes, festival goers, car lovers, all gathered here in majestic Hawaii. These are the festival grounds, but we've got the whole island set up for you we've created a place where you can drive anything from the iconic to the super customized it's a motor fest branded lovingly crafted oh artistry we call these lovelies the playlists and i'm not just reading from the motor fest app here either i tried them out before you arrived and <laughs> here let me show you okay show us Oh shit. This playlist is a unique Motorfest experience. It's called Made in Japan. Oh shit, we actually have to drive. Holy shit! <laughs> what? Okay, we're playing this on normal difficulty. We can also change it later on. I can tell you the handling is much heavier. But it feels better. Maybe feels Japan also more looser way to experience Japanese car culture it's where tarmac meets tradition from mountain peaks to city streets this neon journey is not one to miss oh okay man this game just looks incredible the lighting is it feels like a different game And this isn't even the base of quality. We're playing this on performance mode. For you is what I call a perk of the job. Right in the center of all the action, racing these Japanese drift masters. Just awesome. Okay, that's how you drift. So you press it or you can hold it. Uh, the X button. Just like that. And the drifting feels just so much easier and better. I can already tell. Then the crew too. Wow. Come on, go. All right. Man, you can already tell this game is gonna be incredible. But 
the next playlist was Off-Roading Addict. A chance to race into the wild. Okay. Oh, we are in the Bronco. Um, wonder where they got that idea from. Oh, we also have a rewind button. How does that look? Oh, you can have to hold it. We're gonna test that out in a moment. What? <laughs> Man, that jump. Okay. Driving off road gives you an opportunity to carve your own path, to explore the open expanse. The island becomes your playground. Total freedom becomes your creed. All right, now how do you switch up the camera? Yeah. Uh, oh, right. Okay, there we go. We're more zoomed out. Man, this game is just beautiful. Oh wow. And this Bronco as well. Oh wow. Okay, night just let's boost. Not a jump. Four by fours, pickups, quads. You're given every chance to go off the beaten path. Okay. Man, I'm I'm so hyped this September for this. <laughs> it's a great place to be for racing games. We have DDU coming literally in the beginning of next year we have this and motorsport literally the month of september so <laughs> this is a great place to be no Ooh, damn it go 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 holy shit Okay, now what's the competition? Okay. Okay. Playlist. This one is for the pros. All right, all right. Let's go, let's go. All right. Man, these things are fast and grippy. What the? Okay, we have tire wear as well. Ooh, which is interesting actually. Okay, we have some flaps like a Bugatti. Motorsports is built around racing to the top, the thrill of competing, but it's also about strategic choices, decision making under pressure. Okay, to lose more grip as we go along. All right, we don't have any nitrous. Go to pit lane. Oh, what? It's like Ubisoft takes the best bits of each game. And they added this into this one beautiful game. It's it's incredible, honestly. I I, I have no words. There is no better feeling than triumphing with your team in what some consider the apex of motorsports. Man. These cars are just incredible. Why didn't they give us these cars in the crew too? And I can't wait to make a video on the car list. Oh man, there must be so much cars. Mind you, this is not the final build of the game. They have noted that in the beginning when you load in the game. I mean, it's obviously a beta. Oh, it's just so beautiful. Oh, there's a new Lamborghini racing car. I got to go old school. Bolid, there's a Bugatti Bolid and McLaren Sina. A playlist for the true car aficionado. Oh, we're doing classic style. Okay, I don't mind a little bit of classic. Oh, what UI changes? Oh man, no. This game, is this game, man, it's, it's spoiling us. Or the nostalgia. It's how these things drive, how they feel, how they steer. It was quite a challenge, in the best way possible. Speaking of steering, they have fixed one major issue of the crew one on the crew two as well. Is the steering wheel? It finally moves. 
When would you ever get a chance to take these venerable legends for a spin? That's the power of Vintage Garage. Oh man. Some nice tunes. Of an age where there was no nitro to boost you and no GPS to guide you. Feels strangely comforting. Okay. Man, the, the sun that's coming up right now, oh, I think it's uh, settling. It's just beautiful. Just beautiful lighting overall. And the handling is... Each car feels a lot different, I can tell you that. This thing is much more... Uh, Heavier. So, out with the old and in with the new, they say. The next playlist is legendary. Okay. Bergini, <gasps> a playlist to truly experience the icon. That are well played. I'm running out of adjectives here. Oh man. Okay. First time driving in a Vuelto. As soon as you saw that Lamborghini logo, you knew what this playlist was gonna be. Some of the most recognizable car designs in existence at your disposal. Oh, this thing sounds incredible. Really, it's just amazing, this game. And the models just look so good. Oh! Okay, let's test out the remind. Oh, shit, that's fast. So you have to hold it in. Oh, wow, that's so much better than Forza. Oh, that's, that's like straight to the point. I love it. Oh, this thing raves just so high. And the blue water. Man, this game is just it just feels like something else. It's like a speed race through the story of Lamborghini. One of power and innovation. I think this is a beginning to one of the greatest new racing games here on now. Honestly. Horizon 5 is in my opinion a bit meh. Legends was a rare privilege. A privilege Motorfest graciously gave me. And now, it's your turn. Oh, Jesus! The boost actually does something. Oh, man. Just incredible. Just beautiful masterpiece. Oh, the Yoris. <laughs> like what you saw? Well, those were just the tip of the iceberg. But we've got to go step by step. Follow me. Look around you. This is what it's all about. Cars, bikes, rides, and good vibes. You'll get to explore the festival soon enough. And let's not forget, we're in Hawaii. And there's no better place to express yourself. Show off your flair. Customize your ride. It's a car culture buffet. Keep up. We're going to go meet the star of the show. Your car, of course. Come on. It's time for you to pick your ride. Oh, okay. All right, let's see what we have to work with. Let's just see. Once you pick your car, I'll hand you over to Kara, your personal AI assistant. When in doubt, you can always rely on her to guide you. Okay. I'm gonna go with the BMW. Basically like the Supra. <laughs> Engaged. All engines go. 
Okay. Great selection of cars. Okay, so in this game they're introducing Ready like a sort Japan. of campaign. Race over asphalt and drift through neon in a journey through Japanese car culture. Okay. Hawaii scenic tour. Discover, explore and photograph the hidden charms and captivating beauty of Hawaii. 9-11 Legacy, a Porsche story. Experience the true legacy of Porsche and keep these iconic cars pristine. All right. I love Porsche, but Made in Japan. I mean, we have to go with this. <laughs> we are here. Okay. Oh, first time, like in free room now. A playlist is available, driver. Okay. Um, let's open the map and see what we have to work with. So we are there. Okay, the fireworks are like real time. Right. Okay, okay, so we have to drive all the way here. Through the coast to there. And here is the city. Oh, and you can see all the cars driving around. Man. Okay. The dogs. The volcano. Man. This game, this game. But let's get on the road and go. All right. Let's see. Whoa, the car sounds are different. We put this playlist together to give you a taste of Japanese racing culture. Oh, there's another guy driving beside me. Oh. oh man. That's just gorgeous. Can we actually customize this? Is it possible? Vehicles? Oh, this new menu system just looks incredible. We can upgrade it. How does an upgrade system look like? Oh, it's just like this. Different. Okay. Um... The perf level is definitely a lot different. So th this game is completely different to the rest, and I love that actually. Colors, what colors do we have? Oh, we can go for a black. Oh man. This, the, modern racing games are starting to get mind bogglingly good. I think let's go for a gray. Let's, let's, let's just celebrate by customizing this car. Just to see what we can do. So we can add this hood, we're gonna come back to that. Man, there's a lot of great parts in this. Okay, do we have any white body kits? No, okay. Alright, we just quickly customize this thing, so let's get back to the road. <laughs> now, how do we change like the radio and stuff? How does that work? I'm pressing Y, that's now for rewind. Music player. Japanese oh. vehicles are a modest dream. These souped up speeders pack a part of talk. Oh, okay. Man, this game. Oh. And the steering wheel is just it just blows me away. Oh yeah, baby! We are here! Let's go! Okay, now where do we start this bad boy? Alright, here we go, here we go. Nice dragon. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is insane. I just love these intros. Made in Japan. Okay. 
playlist activated. You discover almost everything the Japanese drivers have to offer. All right. Man, these are a lot of events. Oh shit, is that the whole island? It looks incredible. What? I don't have words. Okay. Let's move on to another activity. All right, now what's that activity? Oh, we have to follow this again. All right. Yes, I'll see you guys there. All right, so we are here. Okay, this is this is a nice menu. I'm not gonna lie, clean and simplistic. I like that. Okay. Sorry you had to wait, kid. Okay. The pack. Wanna show us what you can do? Try this guy then. Are they literally giving me an NSX? What? Okay. Oh shit! Man, this guy. Game on. They're going for some proper Japanese street racing. Let's show them, guys. Gotcha. Got it. Sure. Why not? It feels like a beta Need for Speedy. Uh, not the <laughs> excuse me, I'm bound. Man, the music is banging. I've streamed a mode on and I did not expect the music. Just to show you how it's done, but we don't do free tours here. You gotta play your part and give us a bit of a challenge. No pressure at all. Yeah, don't scare the kid, brother. To be this good. <laughs> Are you familiar with the Honda you're driving? The MSX isn't your regular street car. It was made back in the 90s to stand neck and neck with the likes of Ferrari and Porsche. You sound just like Shingo. Man. Speaking about Shingo, you know that if a rookie beats us with his NSX, we won't hear the end of it, right? I don't even want to think about giving Shingo the satisfaction. Better focus and win this thing, then. All right. the Japanese lanterns going up like to the mountains just beautiful by the way do you know what NSX stands for new sports car experimental I wasn't asking you Hina New sports car experimental. Nice fact, I love that I added facts like that. <laughs> That's good, I actually did not know that. Wow, see that awesome canyon on the left? Eyes on the road, Hina. Wow. That's one huge mountain. And one huge bridge. Oh, that's where we drove the Rivuel, though. I have been practicing to say that name. It's a difficult name to say. Rivuel. I love that festival mood they set. Feels just like our own traditional festival back home. And across the sparky finish line. <laughs> I 
just incredible. Wow. Yay, celebrate! Yeah, baby! Now give me my car. <laughs> just oh, the vibe and atmosphere. It just feels so much more alive. And we got 13,000 bucks for that, which is good. And rare tires. Okay. Wow. Well done. Let's move on to the following event. Now, I'm not gonna completely play through oh, every scene stop. now. Kaneoi. The pack is waiting for you there and is willing to show you some more of the racing culture. Okay. Anyways, I'm not gonna play this completely, but I think before we end the video, let's just take a look at the city. We, what's it called again? Honolulu. Honolulu, yes. Welcome to the car meet. This is the Motorfest social hub, and it's also a place where you can access oh, all flaggy. the features of the festival. <laughs> Check out the main stage where you can join in on the custom show or explore and compete to become a genuine Motorfest legend. Of nice Viper. You already know how wild those can get. Don't Lord forget of the Motorfest monthly theme. We like to change things up around here. Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Around and have fun. Bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, first time running around the main festival with before we go to Honolulu. Okay, let's just quickly look around Welcome here. To the custom show. What? Here you can vote for your favorite vehicles of the week, or register your customized ride to the competition to get rewards based on your ranking. What? You can actually place your car here, I think. Not sure. But damn. Okay. If we go here. Molina Backlar. Just. Oh, and a P1 just right next to it. Just incredible. I mean, this car has a dark on it. We have to vote for it. Let's just vote for it. It's just, it has a dark on it. I mean. This is the top 10. What? This is first place. The Molina. Okay. And of course running around and I love this like... <laughs> like... Zoo type molds around us. It's a nice atmosphere. I'm probably gonna update that. Every like... Season to match with the Battle Pass team. If they choose to add a Battle Pass. Just beautiful. Main stage. You can buy this. Oh no! 800,000. Well, that's a bit out of my price range. <laughs> but yeah, let's go explore Honolulu. I think we are entering Honolulu! There's Honolulu! Oh man. Wait a minute. I think I just noticed something that no game has except except that also with mods. The ambient lighting in cars. That is a feature which I've never seen before in any other game. That is groundbreaking stuff. That's incredible. Okay. So we, there's the main part of Honolulu. This just looks so at home and warm and vibrant there in the crew too. It's just so beautiful and peaceful. Man, you even have a dense city. 
there's even a mall over there. Let's go around here yeah, into like the center of the city. Wow. This game is gonna be insane for role playing. Just the, how the handling feels and like how the hands fight as you can see like there. Let's just get in the sun like that. It's just Forza is getting shat on by many other racing games. I mean, this is the Cruise. No, not the Cruise. <laughs> Fuck. This is the Cruise third game. I mean, Forza is already on its way to the sixth installment. And this is just like. has so many features. And so much things it does better. I mean Forza doesn't have a city. Mind you, I heard the map of this game is um, smaller than Horizon 5's map. It doesn't, it doesn't look like that. But the thing is it's much more denser. And I think that's really what I love about this game. Just like look at the city. In one, in some cases, it looks like Miami or Palm City from Need for Speed. E. And in some cases, it looks like China. And in some cases, it looks like my home country, South Africa. It's, it's just mind blowing. And this is like the show. Wow, just honestly, wow. This is what Forza is supposed to be. And. Can I actually switch to like airplanes? Okay, so we press right button, we can choose to switch to a plane. How do we do that? Oh, we don't have any air vehicle. Okay, well, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. I think that wraps up this video, honestly. This... Let me know in the comments, honestly. This game is brilliant. What are you guys' opinion on this game? Like... Obviously TDU is going to shit on this, um, in some angles, but this and TDU, it's just honestly the most, like in my opinion the most, my English is not very good, uh, the, the best racing games that are like, like ahead of coming out, the best that are like ahead of release, uh, I'm just speechless. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this like video, I want to see more of this, just, just watch and leave a like and a subscribe, it really does help me out, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next Crew Motor Feast video, and watch out, there's some cool stuff coming out.